do another details video on Maya. Obviously the last video was a bit too dark to be able to see anything. Sorry that you can see her cloth body, but this is the only vest that she's got at the moment where you can see her arms. But I do normally put a cardigan with it which makes it look a lot cuter because it's obviously not very nice to see the cloth body. Doesn't look very realistic either. But her hair is gorgeous. The rooting is so good. You can even see the veins slightly through it as well. And oh, sorry, sprayed her hair to brush it early. You've got a little bit of stuff there. Oh, um, stuff I used to do the hair is I saw that um, Danielle, the lady from um, Orchid Reborn Nursery, uses the ragdoll fairy stuff. And Danielle, it is really good. So, yeah, I bought some of that. So thanks for the tip, it really works well. Um, I can do a video later of styling the baby's hair if you like, because I don't just use a comb, I also use a toothbrush. So yeah, that actually really helped. But anyway, back to Maya's details. She's got a lovely vein on her forehead. She's got blotched skin and the details on her eyelids are amazing. She's got rooted eyelashes. But, oh, you can almost see capillaries in her eyelids and stuff. They're just so amazing. She's also got moist lips like William. And her little button nose. And for a um, secreased sculpt, she's actually really detailed. I think she's one of the most detailed um, sculpts that the secreased has done. Because her ears are also really, really detailed. You can see a little vein in her cheek there as well. She's got blotches and veins on her arm as well. And she's got... I love the colour of her skin. It's not too pale and yeah, it's just perfect really. And the same on the other arm, she's got her little band. It says Maya, and when she was born, how long she is and how much she weighs. And that little hand, that's my favourite hand. It's really cute. But yeah, she's so tiny. I mean, this vest is massive on her. But I can't really find anything that fits her that well, really. And I have to say, if there's one thing I don't like about the Zoe sculpt is for a premature baby, she's got quite chunky legs. And they wouldn't really be that chunky. But nevertheless, she's cute anyway, so... Yeah, you can see a vein on her ankle there. And I love the little creases around her foot and she's got tipped and seared nails and that's the bottom of her foot and the same on this leg the blotching's just beautiful and that's the bottom and the veins on that foot as well but yeah I think her detail was a lot more detailed than Williams that sounded really bad but yeah She's a lot more detailed than William, but I prefer the size of William, but she's still really cute. Her face is just gorgeous. But yeah, guys, um, I'll also be doing a um, video on her clothes. So yeah, please request more videos. I'd be so happy if I even get one request, that would just be great. Yeah, thank you guys. That's Maya, my little baby. She's absolutely adorable. Alright, and thank you. Bye.